Hey, what's going on everybody? The Way24 here. I just got home from work as you can see, but while I was sitting here, I was wondering, man, what can I post on my TikTok or any of my socials that could really help other people out that are perhaps wanting to get into streaming and wondering, hey, um, I noticed a lot of streamers are using that Shure SM7B mic, but the only thing is that how do I use that with my PS5? Well, let me show you guys what I do. So guys, as you can see, this is my streaming setup, nothing really crazy, but what we're gonna focus on is the microphone right here. So the problem is we wanna use an XLR microphone, in our case, the Shure SM7B with the PS5. Unfortunately, the PS5 will only recognize the USB signal. So how are we gonna use a microphone that requires an XLR or microphone cable to be recognized with the PS5? Well, the solution is you need an audio interface. And unfortunately, a lot of audio interfaces on the market that you may have heard of like Focusrite or Behringer or any other one that you may think of requires drivers to be installed. Unfortunately, the PS5 cannot recognize any of these drivers. You cannot download the drivers into the PS5. So you need one that is standalone plug and play. And the solution is the Elgato Wave XLR interface. So what it does, it takes the XLR signal or microphone cable signal and converts it to USB. And I'll show you guys right here, look. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna plug in your microphone cable into your microphone. You're gonna route it however you wanna route it. You're gonna plug it into the back right here. It, it has a little connector for you to plug in your XLR microphone cable. And then it feeds out a USB. You see this right here? It has USB type C to USB, I believe, I believe it is type B. And you plug it into the back of your PS5 right here. I believe it's this cable right here. And then what you're gonna do guys is, um, give me just a second while I get the settings opened up. Okay guys, here on the home menu of the PS5, what you're gonna need to do is go to your settings tab, like you would do when you wanna set up your headsets or anything like that. You're gonna go to sound, right there, sound. Then you're gonna select microphone right there. Okay, and what you're gonna do is switch input device to, look at that, Elgato Wave XLR, boom, okay. Now, what you're gonna wanna do, before I go any further, you're gonna adjust the microphone level now. So, just uh, food for thought, the Shure SM7B, and this is probably exclusive to the Shure SM7B. Make sure you are not feeding extra 48 volt phantom power into this microphone, you will destroy the microphone. So as you see right here on the interface, you see 48 phantom volts, it is not lit up. Make sure that before you plug in your microphone that that is not on. Um, there should be somewhere in the, in the instructions that shows you how to turn that off. So what you're gonna do guys, make sure that's off before you do anything. Now, oh yeah, also guys, um, whenever you turn on your PS5, you're gonna have to do this step every single time. Unfortunately, the PS5 is not gonna recognize the interface right away. You're gonna have to switch it on through input device every single time you turn it on. But it's a workaround, so at least we can get it to work. So now we're gonna adjust microphone level. Due to the nature of this microphone, um, for some reason, it does not have a lot of pre-gain installed into it. So what that means is that um, usually microphones have a good amount of pre-gain installed into it and can also use phantom power, which this one cannot use, which will allow it to pick up a signal with a lot less gain. So these require a lot more gain in order to work. Unfortunately, when you put too much gain, you hear that hissing sound. That's where that hissing sound you hear it comes from. You're going to get a slight hiss, but not too much. As long as you don't have too much, that's perfect, okay? So the way we set it up, guys, first off, let's lower this all the way down. For this specific microphone, I found that the sweet spot on the XLR is you want to make sure that this is lighting lit up. You, you select that by clicking the buttons here. You see that how it's switching menus? Okay, we're going to make sure that we're on microphone and we're going to set it to the sweet spot, which I found for this interface is about right there. Right there is perfect, guys. Anything, you, maybe you can go one more, but right there is where I usually like to live. And then on this menu, we're going to put the microphone to our mouth like the way we would whenever we're going to be streaming. Have it close to your mouth, guys. And then we're gonna talk into the microphone and raise up now the, the right here, the, the signal on the console until we can get into our sweet spot, which is, which is usually right here, guys. You don't need it any louder than that. Anything louder than that, if you're green all the way over here, you're gonna be picking up a lot of background audio and you don't want that. You want it to be as isolated as possible. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna select that. And as we talk, guys, talk normal. Talk as you would talk like if you're streaming. Don't be talking all soft because then your microphone level is not gonna be correct. Okay guys, so what we're gonna do as we talk, we're gonna select it and we're gonna raise it up. Keep talking, keep talking, mic test, mic test, testing, one, two. Mic test, testing, one, two, right there. You see that? Maybe even lower it down a little bit because we're gonna talk a little bit louder. You know how we, how we yell when, when we're playing games. So mic test, yeah, there you go. See, that's okay for it to, 
for it to break that, like occasionally when you're screaming, as long as it doesn't buzz, um, the way you can kind of monitor that is by wearing your headsets as you're adjusting this and you'll be able to hear how your microphone sounds um, as you're speaking. So right there is perfect, guys, for me. And that's pretty much all you guys need to do in order to get your microphone USB via XLR into the PS5, guys. I hope you guys like the content. If you like it, guys, please like and also follow my TikTok page, my Instagram page, and my Facebook page. Um, if you want to see more content like this, see you guys later. Number and it one. should sound like this. Today's mystery chocolate punishment is going to be number one in the count of one, two, three. What the hell was that?